I promise you that this video that you're about to watch today will be the shortest tutorial you will ever see because that's how easy it is. Okay, now stay tuned. So what supplies would you need? I found this curb chain in the brightest flashiest gold that I can find. You can see how thick it is. I'll put it up against the black here. So you can see how beautiful, flashy. I have my little jump ring opener. You put it on your finger, open up jump rings. I'll show you how to use that. Okay, so I just have a pair of just pliers. I have two lobster claws. Then I'm gonna need two jump rings that I do not have for some reason. Short video, my booty. So then we need two jump rings. Of course I have my pliers. I have these um, pliers that my husband had gotten me. I'll find something similar to it. I think they use it for um, electrical wire, but um, it's by SATA or S-A-T-A. And I have a little simple mask that I use all the time, but what's important about the mask is they have to have these little loops, okay? The loops is what makes this project, okay? You need to have the loops. Um, some people have the masks that go around their heads and, you know, one ties and one ties on the bottom, one ties on the top, or they have the ones that could just go behind your ears, but it's so tight that this just isn't going to work. You need the ones with the loops that have these little stoppers on them that is that are adjustable so that's what you need because it makes its own little loop right here so that's what you're that's what you're looking for in a mask okay we're gonna set the mask aside you have our pliers so what I'm gonna do is I want to take off a little piece of this oh so yeah I am actually wearing a piece that I just cut off you can just stay tuned okay but look how it looks and the thing about this one is is that it's adjustable because of the lobster claws that we're using today the lobster claws actually fit in to any loop on here making it super duper adjustable so you could just have it really really low or really really high i mean come on seriously so anyway so what i'm going to do is i'm going to take my chain right here and I'm gonna wrap it around. So I wanna see for myself because it's adjustable. This thing is going to be adjustable, but um, I just wanna see how low I want it to be because I want it to hang about like right here. So I'm gonna look at it, I'm gonna mark it with my finger because, yeah. And um, so I'm gonna mark it because this is where I want it to be. Did you just drink Bronco's water? Oh my God. So anyway. So I'm going to mark it with my finger here because this is the end. Okay, so I want to cut it about right here. So the thing about cutting it, I am going to use these really hefty cutters. And so the thing about it is it's like the material this is made out of, I'm not sure but it will be in the description box below in the supplies but this this cutter cuts it pretty good you can i kind of feel it going down yeah i feel it squishing down it's not like it's copper or anything i just don't know what kind of material it is but what you do is i made a little cut made a little cut in it uh, yeah you can see it right about right here where my thumb is so i made a little cut in there and so what i'm going to do is instead of cutting all the way through I'm just going to put my pliers on here they do open but it's not very easy to open so I'm just gonna move that around and then you can just take that loop off and then here you go okay not every one of these loops is open right here so you have to cut it I feel like they're all soldered closed so Using a cutter is your best bet with this particular wire that I'm going to put in the description box below. So I got my little length of wire here, okay? Then I'm going to take my pliers right here in my one, my right hand, 
and the thing about this ring is it has different types of slots on it so you have like you know a medium slot here and a really really small one and then you have a really really tiny one over here and a really really large one right here so I am just going to go into this medium one on the side right here so what I'm going to do is going to pick up my jump ring making sure that I have my opening at the top right here I'm going to put my jump ring in I'm just going to take my pliers here and I'm just going to move it back and kind of this holds it in place this one twists it apart so now you have an open jump ring now take one of your lobster claws put it in that jump ring take one end of your chain put that in the jump ring also okay now I'm going to make sure that I have enough room to go into my ring right here okay and I'm going to put it in the ring use my pliers twist it close and that's how that works again let's see that again I got my jump ring make sure the opening is at the top put it in to the slot hold it in place twist it apart with your pliers okay grab your lobster claw put that on grab your chain put that on the jump ring make sure you have enough space for it to go into the slot hold it in place use your pliers to twist it closed and you are done kind of so then now you're going to take your you're going to take your mask right here so I know that this is the top because this this mask has a little wire in there because if I ain't have that wire on my nose um yeah uh, my glasses be fogging up y'all so now I'm going to take now we have our own little loop right here because we have the stopper so we're going to slip that into the lobster claw it's big enough to fit all that fabric then I'm going to grab the other end and clip it to the other side into that loop close it and you have your little mask thing and so you could just slip it right over your neck if you're not wearing the mask it could just hang down but if you're going to wear the mask put it on okay and so that's and that's how it's done okay and so it just hangs down like that okay I love it so this has really saved my life I tell you what this has really saved my life because there are times when I'm like oh no I'm not paying attention um I forgot my mask in the car I have I don't have that problem anymore I just put my mask on all my masks are on a chain and I just hang them by the door and then when I leave they're right next to my keys sometimes I even attach it to my keys and then I just walk out the door and Bob's your uncle didn't I tell you it was gonna be the quickest video you ever had also another thing about this video is there's something in this video that is a clue to my next video card somewhere in this video but anyway um I see you sleeping baby <laughs> so anyway you guys oh god you're falling okay I think you might need to go to your bed because I can't I can't do this this ain't gonna work for me you're hot I got a jacket on oh, dude. it's like having a baby bro so anyway you guys thank you so much for watching be sure to like subscribe and comment because that's what all the other youtubers are telling me I should say and as always I'll see you in the next video bye bye bye